Hello, welcome to SimpleScuba.com. In this session, we will look at the Aqualung Traveller 1550 wheeled bag. So let's take a closer look. If we have a look at the exterior of the bag first. The bag itself made from a high wear nylon. Helps to uh, obviously keep it nice and lightweight, but the nylon is particularly tough as well, so it will last a very long time. It's a travel bag, so they've uh, tried to reduce as much material as possible. Because it's a wheel bag, you've got the padded and supported back and bottom as well, which obviously houses the wheels on the bottom. Also houses a telescopic handle as well. So by pushing the button, you can extend that handle, makes it very easy to run through airports or over period distances. Obviously with the wheels, it makes it that much easier to transport the bag. On the outside, got big grab handles, top and bottom. Also got one on this side as well, so it makes it nice and easy to lift the bag in and out of uh, uh, trucks or trolleys or anything you might be using at an airport or over long distances. The main compartment is accessed by a big U-zip on the front, big toggles on there, nice big zip, makes it nice and easy to use, very smooth action as well. And then, as you can see, big compartment inside, got compression straps as well, just quick release which allows you to put the equipment in, dart your buckles, and you can pull that down, compressing as much air out of it as possible, fitting as much in as you can. Also got fin compartments as well, so you can orientate your fins according to the symbols on the top. That just fits in there, and it helps to protect the side of the bags and the equipment inside. Obviously, it being a travel bag, it's designed to be as light as possible. So they've stripped out the padding on the side and they've gone for having the fins down the sides to give that protection to the equipment inside. So obviously you save a fair amount of weight, but also gain extra space as well. Again, nice and easy to do up. Zips both sides. If we have a look at the back of the bag and the backpack system. On the back of the 1550, you can see we've got a Luggage slot in there, also you can slide the details in there, makes it nice and secure, stops that falling out, and it's a very easy means of uh, identifying your bag if you need to. But also the main feature on the back of this bag is a zip section at the top, and in here we have a couple of shoulder straps. Nicely padded, so obviously not gonna be uncomfortable to wear over a, a length of time. And down in these corners, if you just pull out these buckles here, you've got the Rest of the shoulder strap, quick release obviously, adjustable, so you need to pull down the strap to your desired length, and that obviously locks into place as a quick release buckle does. Obviously you can make it longer as well, just by lifting it up and pulling it through. Obviously you've got one both sides, so you just pull out there, and then you've got rack sack style, makes it nice and easy to carry.